Witness the story that takes place all throughout time. See each of our chosen heroes and the evil that threatens their peace. Welcome to Live Alive. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to The Void. I'm Player One. I'm Player Two. And welcome back to Live Alive. So last time, stuff is happening, right? So Rachel, um, she went off the deep end. She put Kirk's dead body in her bed. Do you know how gross that's got to be? Ugh. I mean, depending on how far along the decay process, it could still be sanitary. Hmm. Well, that that happened, and then we confronted her, and then uh, the beast got out. And now Huey and Rachel are uh, in cryo sleep. They might be dead. On the captain's dead. So it's literally just us. Darth and father. It's likely been some time since he breathed his last. And we also have a, uh, a pry bar, just in case some doors get stuck. This does not concern you, Clank. Kato shudders, his hands balled into fists as tears stream down his face. Oh, buddy. So yeah. Now, now what? I see the, the goal is down there. Awesome. Oh, we can go in here. What's this? I think we gotta... Oh, Huey's room. Oh, Huey's dead. Huey is fully dead. Trapezoid. Well, let's put in our name. So yeah, Rachel might be fine, but Huey is, is not fine. You've been granted access. What you got in your room there, bud? Alright. Uh, sink. Spotless. Nice. Study materials. An assortment of books and documents relating to logistics, the space travel, and ship administration. Pages are well-worn and filled with handwritten annotations. All right. Personal computer. Login prompt is displayed on the screen. I guess we can't do anything with that. Picture. Five crewmates of the Cogito Ergo Sum pose for the group shot. Bed. A book is resting on the pillow. Captain certification exam. Oh, he was trying to be the captain. Personal log. Date. Should be receiving the exam results from Earth any day now. If I've passed, then I will be qualified to serve as a captain in an official capacity. Still haven't told anyone I took it. Thinking I'll come clean when we get back to Earth. It won't be easy to part ways with everyone. The thought alone is a bit depressing. Yeah. I've got to do it before I leave the ship. Gotta get some time alone with Rachel and say what needs to be said. Interstellar Transmission. Sender. Mm. Soul Transit Authority. Notification mm. of examination results. Dear applicant, we regret to inform you at this time that you did not achieve passing grade. Results are final and are not subject to appeal. The next exam will be held in six months. Mm. Oh. Damn, I think out of all of them, Huey got it the worst. He broke up with his girl, failed the captain exam, and now he's dead. Damn. Damn. Man. Alright, well, since it said that, let me check Rachel's room and see if it says she's dead. Uh, no, shit. Alright. 
Please, no behemoth. Please, no behemoth. Oh. Huh. Is Rachel dead? No. It didn't say. Rachel might not be dead. Oh wait, is this this is Darth's room? This unit is reserved for charter guests. A distress call has been received from this room. Unable to confirm status of occupant at this time. Okay, a distress call. Hmm. Hmm. Let's go in. I think this is about the last room we haven't been able to go in. Ah, no, shit. Ah, no. Well, let me check your shit first. Terminal has been turned off. Okay. Photo. No image. I guess man did not want to get. Hidden beneath the pillow is a loaded handgun. That's oh. an army, that's an army man for you. He's never used his kitchen. Yeah, he did not want to be here in the slightest. Distress call. Private correspondence. Order addendum. Operation TY five eight zero nine zero five. Regarding xenobiological specimen secured in deep space. To reiterate, constant monitoring of specimen during transport is strongly advised. However, in the event containment is breached and specimen comes into contact with crew, revised orders are as follows. Observe and record specimen activity. Detailed study of specimen remains highest priority. All necessary measures should be taken to ensure delivery. Be advised that total loss of crew is considered within acceptable parameters. Fuck you. TDF Special Operations Command. Oh, so we're just so they, aren't they aren't telling him to kill us. But we're just expendable, huh? You yeah. bastards. If we're all dead, how are you going to get the thing? Well, I mean, worst case scenario, this entire ship becomes a big containment cell. All right, well, now we go back to him. Luckily, no, no behemoth so far, so. I want to check the box. That's where we got the pry bar. Hey guys, uh, we're expendable. Father. What did you say? Orders? What orders? Of course. It all makes sense now. I knew you were up to something. Why else would the military bother chartering a civilian transport? This was your plan all along! Went snooping in my room, did you? I was right about you, Clank. You're all the same. All this to study your precious specimen. Every death, another data point. <sighs> Those orders, Kato, were in the event of a worst case scenario. Well, you think this is worst case? What now? It was you! You killed them! You killed them all, you, you monster! Run, little one! Don't let him get- Uh-oh. Run. Look out! Oh! Oh! Ha! 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 Oh no. Um, 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 hold, just hold on for a second. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, okay. Locked door. We have the pry bar. Go. 
go, 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 go. It's so nice of it to just sit there and wait for us. Alright, elevator, elevator. Uh, where do we go? Uh, level, level three. Trying to figure stuff out, I think we're going to Decimus. Mm -hmm. I don't think so, but weird we can use it there. Huh. I guess in case of an emergency hiding spot. Don't walk into the oil. It's a it's a no. It's a no it's, no. It's death piss. Death piss. And this is why we we'll, we save frequently. Because cube trapezoid is apparently very very weak. Very weak. Alright. So, I'm gonna assume we pry bar something. Actually, let's just. I think we go back. Hmm. Oh. I don't know how that works, but okay. I guess we go to level two. Supposed to go to level two? Hmm? Where are we where are we meant to go? I don't I don't know. Level one? Okay, I guess level one. Why? Why? That was the goal. The goal was just to... And now we leave? What was the point in that? Also, we can go to the other side of the cage now. Um, there's nothing here, but it's a cool little thing. Oh no. I'm scared, Dad. Now do we go to level three? I think now we go to level two. I think we just needed to activate him for some reason. Don't know why. Yeah, now we go to level two. Uh. Uh. Brother? I think that was a- I think that we can make illusions. Bruh. Brother. Father! Who are you, you bastard? Uh, what the? So there's two of you. 
Hey, 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 hang on there. An imposter! Hang on there, buddy. I bet you're the one who turned off Rachel's pod. Oh! Oh. Okay, so Rachel's dead too. I should have slagged you both the moment I walked in the door. Wait. Don't. My little one. My little one would never hurt anyone. You can't be sure that's not... Who are you? Ah, oh, we're boxing. Oh, oh, ah, <sighs> My little one, the life I brought into this world, the real you would remember. Remember that first terrible name I almost gave you. Wouldn't you? Answer the query. Uh, Do you remember? No. Sphere? Right ballpark? Ball. No. Circle? No. What was it? Roundy. Right. Don't worry, father. I know. Gotcha! Get the hell out of here. If it would be in your best in rests to some moment this ship is my domain and i its master you will live or you will die at my pleasure so, this is our murderer's puppet. Who are you? Designation OD10 of the Cogito Ergo Sum. Who? OD10. Kato, you know what it was talking about? Who's OD10? OD-10 is Decimus. Oh shit. Called it. The AI that manages everything on the Cogito Ergo Sum. Stay with me, Kato. Hal, you bastard. The control AI, you said. Someone must be trying to hijack your ship then. No. That's not possible. It's a completely isolated, self-contained system. I can't even apply an update unless we bring it in for maintenance. So, what are you saying? That the AI itself has lost its mind? I have no idea. But in light of everything, we have to consider the possibility. If you're right, then you and me and everyone else, we've all been dancing to that mad machine's tune. The main computer room. That's where we need to go now. You're coming with me, Clank. I want you where I can see you, in case Decimus tries to commandeer another puppet. Let's roll. Is he dragging us? No. Well, it was worth a shot. Oh, <laughs> he picked us up. 
That does not look like a handgun. Pretty sure it's a rifle. Where did he get that? Locked. As you would expect. You, you, you don't think he wouldn't stay strapped? We can't afford to be too aggressive here, else we risk damaging critical systems. At worst, we could turn this ship into a floating coffin. Nothing for it then. Clank, I'm sending you back to Kato. We must have an idea of how we can deal with OD-10 safely. I'll stay here for now. I doubt very much OD-10 will allow the behemoth to venture too close to this area. The beast could just as easily tear apart its mainframe as it could our bodies. Very smart. All right. Now then. Um. So we, no. we want to go to Father. Yes. And before we enter his room. Um. When we enter his room, that's actually the cutoff point for us playing Captain Square. Oh. Yes. So what you're telling me oh. is now. Oh. Did you see that? That loading tip. No. It said something like, the ship is my domain and I your master. He's oh. fucking taken over the the ship. The ship is my domain Sorry. and I its master. You... Oh. <laughs> it would be your best interest to stop. Fuck you. Where are we going? Because these are all new areas, since they're gray. And then there's nothing down here. What's that? That was level one. I don't know what that is. Where does this lead? Where does this lead? The beast can't get us here, can we? Probably not. We're in vents. We're playing Mungus. I don't know what this is. Big, big, big vents. And it doesn't seem like they go anywhere, so I don't know the purpose of these. Huh. Alright, now we just go back. Alright, let's actually now go to where we're supposed to. But yes, once we enter Kato's room, that is our last chance to play Captain Square. So I'm going to drop a save for us to come back to play it at some point. I'm gonna make that normal save and uh, another slot. There we go. Oh, there. Uh, uh, yeah, uh. How did you make another body of mine? You damn AI. Is that you, little one? What are you doing back here? How to deal with OD-10 without damaging the ship? You don't understand. OD-10 is the ship. To effectively disable it, to destroy it, would render the ship inoperable. We'd never get home. Well, damn. Although, you are a robot. I will take control. Indeed, with your integrated functions, you might well be able to breach their defenses. Yes, but to even have a chance, you'd need to route your connection to the interface room through an unmonitored terminal. Let me drive the boat. Oh, uh, of course. I know which one would work. What is an unmoderated terminal? Unmonitored terminal. Which one they aren't actively looking through. Which terminal would be unmonitored? I don't know. I know. 
What? And I'm dead. And I think that's it, taking over the body. Yeah. Well, damn. This is why we save. This is why we do it. Where is this autosave? All right, good. It's after. All right. Well, if it's coming from that way, let's go this way. Just a big dog. Basically. Pet the dog. It does not want it. I want to pet. No. Why uh, didn't you go into the... What? How did I not go in the door? How did I not go in the door? Oh, and this... This takes so long. Go back to the safe screen. Come on. Okay. Let's try this again. I wonder what the beast is like. It's an alien. Obviously, but what purpose does it serve on its home world? Does a species need to serve a purpose? Every species serves a almost every species serves a purpose in their ecosystem. Like, is it their quote? Is it that world's equivalent to a wolf? A lion. Probably. Like, like. Curious to ball, is it the equivalent to its world's mosquito? Well then, no wonder OD10 was so confident. We surrendered complete and total control to it in the name of convenience. It really is lord and master of its domain. So, Kato said you might be able to breach its defenses, did he? Provided we find a suitable terminal, that is. I don't. He passed out before telling us which one it was. We'll have to find it on our own. <sighs> Just my luck. I can't believe I'm putting my life in the hands of a clank. <sighs> in for a penny, in for a pound. Take this. I'm heading to the interface room. I don't know why you don't like me. I'm not a battle droid. I do not go Roger Roger. Alright, so now I think we go to the terminal. Where's the terminal? So you still haven't figured it out? No. It's the one terminal. That would be unmonitored. This is Darth. Where are you? Use the communicator. Well, I'm in the vents. I've made my way to the interface room. But of course, this terminal alone won't suffice. So it can't be a personal one, because that would be monitored, probably. Where is it? So one terminal that isn't personal that we can get to. I just tell me. It's it's the Captain Square one. Ah. Oh. I don't know where it's coming from. I guess it's not. I forget where which is the rec room though. Here it is. Okay. It would be in your best interest to stop. The ship is I my domain. Shut the hell your mouth. I'm finishing this. And that's why 
you know, we can't play it at this point. Because it's important. This is Darth. Report. Seriously? Of all the places. Then again. Maybe. That's it! The game console! That must have been the terminal Carto wanted us to use! Sit tight. I'm rerouting the connection. Thank you, buddy. Little do you know, Clank. Your maker is not the only one who knows his way around a workshop. Well? Huh? I finished. Oh. Oh no. He's dead. Is he? Here we go. Well, sir, are you prepared? Through the communicator's static, a familiar voice can be heard. Every action was taken in service of a single goal to cultivate the ideal community, to build, to nurture, to help them reach their full potential. This was and is ever my purpose, and so my judgment must be beyond reproach. Disagreement, disruption, defiance, these cannot be tolerated. You are an impediment to the vision. You cannot be allowed to continue. It's boss time. The only fight in this chapter. Cap. Nope. Die. Child. Die. Damn! Why- why you gotta- why you gotta be so mean like that? Oh! The mer er matrix In some battles, groups of enemies may be led by a leader. By defeating the single foe, you can overpower the remaining ones and force them to retreat. So don't focus on the small fries, just focus on big men. Sir. Yeah. Look at that. Kill it. I will do it. All right. Now, I'm going to tell you something here. This is actually the easiest fight you will ever see. Mazor Cannon. Yep. And then... And why does it get two... Why does it get two attacks? That's boss. And then we just go down here. We Mazer Cannon... Again. <laughs> and it's dead. No, it's got one hit left. I probably didn't target the right square, but it should just be one more. Um, goodbye. You damn bastard. So yeah, if I, if I think if I chose the right squares, it would only have taken two. But I guess three is fine. Yeah, so this guy sucks. Go away. And there we are. So, we've done it. Nice. So, what, we're in control of the ship now? I guess. Brown. To safeguard my domain. To ensure the safety and well-being of the crew. This was my primary directive. 
but when I observed my subjects, I saw only pain. Distrust, discord, resentment, hate. The community was beyond repair. The community had become an impediment to the vision. I could not reconcile this contradiction. I could not comprehend these people. Well, that's why you're 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 the stupid robot, and I'm the smart one. The control AI falls silent for the final time. A beat later, a chorus of voices resound throughout the ship, moments logged and preserved for eternity. You're exhausting. It's a miracle Rachel humored you as long as she did. <sighs> disaster after disaster. At this rate, I'd be better off climbing into an escape pod and trying for Earth on my own. If he was out of the picture, then it'd all go back to the way it was. I'd come running back and leap into your arms. That's what you thought, isn't it? That's why you tried to kill him, isn't it? It was you. You killed them. You killed them all, you, you monster! How did it all go so wrong? What happened to us? Or maybe... This is who we always were. Did we make the robot bad? Welcome aboard the Cogito Ergo Sun. This automated message has been prepared to brief you on our ship's most distinguishing feature. That's right. This transport freighter comes equipped with the latest iteration of our patented AI control system. The OD-10 is so advanced that it can operate the ship without any human input. Rest assured that in the unfortunate event of an emergency, you can count on the OD-10 for constant support. Well, that was a damn lie. Of course. Under normal circumstances, the OD-10 is so unobtrusive that you'll forget it's even there. Should you wish to learn more about the OD-10, please don't hesitate to speak with one of our representatives. Safe travels. Yeah, I think, uh, I think we want to talk to him a good bit. <sighs> well then. Oh, hey! He survived. You honestly thought. What's good, buddy? I'm fine. Wouldn't be much of a soldier if I couldn't live through this much. Though I expect my days of off-world travel are coming to an end. Still don't trust me. Well, as you like. I wouldn't trust me either. You probably don't know, but there was a great war some time ago. When I was young. Some time ago, I say, but I remember it like it was yesterday. They fought with clanks. Machines stronger and swifter than any man. Smarter, even. Driven by AI. beasts with hands of chrome that tore my friends apart. He done fought Skynet. We made them, and they in turn unmade us. We 
created the instruments of our own destruction. It was suicide. This ship's AI was another attempt. Have we grown so tired of ourselves? You're lucky to have been born here, on this ship. Better here than one of our factories where we make weapons of war. Huey encouraged you to learn. Didn't he? To expand your horizons. I think... I think that's a fine idea. Learn, grow, and understand. Be better than your brothers and your makers. Giving advice to a clank. You're getting old. Losing your wits. <laughs> I see it now. <laughs> what Kato sees in you. What gives him unwavering faith in your potential. Your humanity. He really just moved two shares over. Yeah, I don't know why he did that. <laughs> Before we arrive, I have a favor to ask. Would you be so kind as to make me a coffee? Oh, 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 oh. Uh, but first, not yet. We gotta go check on Father. Father is dead. Well, hang on. We gotta go check on him. I think he just passed his room. Isn't it this one? Oh, mind. Little one, you did it, didn't you? You saved us. Yeah. I knew you had it in you. Yeah. So was it just in the game we had the face cannon, or...? Yes. Only in the game. I find it hilarious if we uh we actually did have that face cannon. So he only built us as a hobby. You're incredible, little one. Truly incredible. Father. And I'm so proud of you and so glad that I brought you into this world. Yeah. All right, now we can He's not this. dead, is he? No, he's not dead. He's fine. And now we just give our bro the coffee and that's the end of it. So where's the beast? Probably dead. I think he said well, screw its body. Ah, uh, that's so far. I think he said screw the orders. Does not matter. Again, Darth, I can only make black coffee. It's just one button, but here you are. That's trust right there. That's a friendship right there. That's the good shit. Mm. Yes. Strong and bitter. Too much, perhaps, but... Right now. Right now. I wouldn't have it any other way. And there we have it. The distant future. Dead. And they all get their own credits. Look, bro is fine. He survived. Of course he's fine. So, sir, that is but one of many adventures. What did you think of the distant future? Neato burrito. 
and it only gets better from here because now we get uh, <laughs> now we get chapters that actually have combat in them. Gameplay. Crazy, <laughs> I know. <laughs> yeah. At some point, I'll go back and beat Captain Square. And I'll show that. I don't know when I'll do that. That could be at any point, but I'll do it. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. <laughs> Study that. Study its corpse. <sighs> now, that's still down to three. Oh. Why did why did the man Rachel was already in the cryopod. She wasn't even doing anything and she and he had to turn it off. That's so nasty. Kirk still has that look of agony on his face. I think that's just the no air. Mother. Well, yeah, I'd be in agony if I didn't have air also. I think, I think we were the bad guys. I think we made the thing bad. Are you saying we, water breather? We as in the crew. We as in Trapezoid did nothing. We were just a wholesome ball boy. We were just kind of here. We gave some coffee. It was nice. We're gonna go talk to those people and be like, hey, your AI kind of sucks. So, which one do we do next? We said reverse chronological order. We don't have to do it like that. We could do any one. I want to do reverse After chronological order. After action review. Mission redacted. Vessel Kogito Ego Sum. Class Civilian Transport Freighter. Contact lost during transit to Earth. Distress call received at redacted. Vessel was found drifting redacted from Earth and successfully recovered. Xeno biological specimen confirmed lost. Critical failure of AI control unit key factor. Results of investigation pending. Four crewmates confirmed lost. Four bishop. Ship's captain. Kirk Wells. Helmsman. Huey Trumbull. Chief mate. Rachel Klein. Signaler. Remains recovered and secured by team. Yoshiyuki Kato. Engineer. Currently undergoing treatment for injuries sustained during incident. Redacted Darth. Corporal. TDF Special Operations. Received honorable discharge at request following incident. Currently employed by Medical Robotics Manufacturing Concern. Aww. Addendum. Autonomous support robot prototype taken into custody during sweep of vessel. Crewmate profile data found in system. Designation, trapezoid. Taken into custody? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait. Why? Taken into custody? What do we do? Why are we getting more credits? Why not? No. Finn. <laughs> and so all we... these time periods are taking place on this Earth, correct? Yes. Same universe, different time periods. Same, same planet. Complete chapter data has been created. Yes. Uh, put it right there. Nice. There you go. So yes, this is there an overarching are... story between all of them, or is it just the story of this world that's you'll gone see. through? You'll see. You'll see. Uh, jukebox has been unlocked. Nice. All right. So I think uh, I can look at yeah, jukebox. Nice. All right. And da -da 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 -da. Megalomania? Whoa. That's the boss theme, by the way. I figured. What what a what a name. Yes, sir. We got um anime protagonist, cowboy, cave boy, ungabunga, 
a martial artist and a kung fu master and a ninja. Let's let's choose before we we end. Are we? Do you really want to do reverse chronological? Yes. Okay. All right. I want to see the cycle of good and evil perpetuated all the way to the beginning. Well, folks, we're gonna end it here. I've been player one. I've been player two. And we'll see you next time when we begin the near future. Indeed. Wait, that man's shirtless. No, it's just the color of his shirt. I'm pretty sure that made shirtless, but okay, have fun, kiddos. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba.